You are loved, Manawak. You are loved so, 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 so much. Very long. Mm -hmm. But you know what? Mm -hmm. At least I've been seeing you. Guys, I was literally laughing my ass out. Like, today, oh my God, people that are shocking us, the viewers and the housemates, each day and we like what we're seeing because i really didn't expect this i expected that it was going to be phone calls or video calls you know talking to family and friends we didn't know that this family and friends were going to visit big brother's house and have a fill time so big brother uh, invited certain family members of some of the housemates and i think it's going to run for the whole week and these housemates, uh, relatives are going to spend, uh, time, I think one to five minutes. And from the time they enter, they're going to go check up on their own person, encourage them, support them and just uplift their spirit. And this particular one made me laugh a lot. It was Papa Ghost's, uh, sister now she came in was talking and singing happy birthday and then boom it dawned on me that it was papa ghost's birthday and she was like she's not going to tell anybody she's not going to mention the name when she gets back she started scanning the house she went to the kitchen she went to the head of house lounge she went to the room i think she went a bit to the garden and then she came back and completely completely sang for papa ghost wishing him a happy birthday that she misses him she misses um his hug and how he used to treat her and then he started she started encouraging him that he needs to learn to start treating ladies nicely talk to them nicely treat them nicely of course he's not he should not let his guard down and should not let anybody toy and joke with him right but then he treats the ladies the way their mom raised him because even his brother is encouraging that he should do the same and then she also shaded uh yolanda say ah shem yolanda you're too noisy you're too raz you're too raz and of course yolanda was smiling some of the housemates giggled this lady was just talking about all the other people oh you look nice nice to see you guys it's nice to do this it's nice to do that she was now like asking you guys don't cook what time do you guys eat because i don't understand papa goes once more make sure you play a game right we're seeing you i'm actually sad the mama goes had to leave but you came here alone and you have to leave alone and you have to leave with a two million rand because you need to start you know taking care of me i miss the way you pamper me you need to take me out do this do that soon enough we heard the buzzer for her to get to leave and you know she shared kisses and told everyone she loved them and soon as she was going to leave she ran back i was like oh i need to get ice cream she went and took the ice cream <laughs> i'm like this girl has energy she has a lot of energy and then when she left big brother was like housemates on feed i did the housemates went chaotic they were shouting and screaming yolanda ran to a papa goes grab his hand i was shaking oh my god that's your sister she's cute she's stunning damn you guys look alike a little bit oh my god how oh, she's still pretty you guys know how Yolanda can be. She would just scream at the top of her voice and almost block your ear. Every other housemate was shocked. The housemate started saying, oh, they actually thought at the point that it was uh, McJunior's girlfriend. And he was like, nah, that's not his girlfriend. People were laughing. They were now talking about how um, Papa Gosa and his sister look alike. And then he was like, oh, thank God it was not his mom that he doesn't want or he didn't want his mom to come. And I'm like, oh, was he having issues with his mother or something? Because he said it with such seriousness. And then he said that the... The, his sister they have the same mother but different fathers and then of course that she's a model and an influencer they're like yeah of course that shows because 
come on that's crazy i'm like i have big you know if you guys damn yolanda kept adding that um she looked and she was giving the vibe of um cosy she's stunning that right now in fact she does she's not beefing with uh papa ghost anymore because of his sister she likes his sister she would like to you know connect with him most of the housemates added uh she liked to connect to her of course and most of the housemates added that they actually thought it was a big celebrity because they had never seen somebody as stunning and beautiful the way she dressed and everything that was something they really loved then we had the very chaotic emotional moment that Mpumi's mother came into big brother's house and such a nice woman because she started by complimenting and greeting every housemate even as they were frozen she was like oh my keke oh z papa goes your man speaking part i was like oh that's really cute like literally each person she came across with she would just say something nice to you look good you look stunning this house looks so good and i really loved the energy she gave and then it came to the point where she got to um um, pull me in the garden around where they were sitting there was yolanda there was young papi there was z and there was uh, liema and this girl just started crying she busted out crying like literally you could feel the emotions it was really really emotional at some point tears rolled down my face and then her mother started saying uh, we've been thinking about you we talk about you every day stay strong you are loved you are so loved we love you so much you can't even begin to understand play the game have fun uh you then i think she started complimenting other persons who were there like literally it was so so good to watch i could not contain my joy and then uh towards later after some time of the house being unfrozen big brother froze them up again and then Willie's mom came in and, you know, started complimenting the housemates just the way um, um, Mpumi's mom did. She complimented my keke, uh, Papa Ghost, Sinaye, a number of the housemates. She went to the kitchen and then went to the garden where um, he was lying down and she started saying hello. And then he was really saying, that voice sounds like my mom. And then she came in front of him. I was like, my baby boy, my vibrant baby boy, you're doing good, but don't stop. Keep pushing, keep pushing till the end. You deserve it. You keep winning. That's my boy. We're talking about you. We're thinking about you. And we know you're going to get to the end victorious. Don't stop or stop pushing. It was just nice to hear. Like literally today, like forget all the enmity every of the housemates are having towards each other and stuff this was the real deal watching these guys and their family have this one-on-one -on -one, it was really crazy it was sad that they were not permitted to hug or touch each other but it was good anyways i'm going to see you guys on the next video so stick around